Happening today, the humanitarian crisis continues in Puerto Rico following a series of devastating hurricanes and earthquakes. Senator Richard Blumenthal will be visiting the island today to survey all the damage. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Eva Zamaris joins us live from the newsroom with how we are now getting a firsthand look. Eva. Good morning to you, Irene. My colleague Matthew Campbell is the only Connecticut reporter down in Puerto Rico. He'll be following Senator Richard Blumenthal today as he does toward the island. Together, they'll be speaking with people to better understand what more needs to be done. Drone 3 flew high above Ponce, giving us an aerial view along Puerto Rico's southern coast. Earthquakes and hurricanes ravaged the island these past few years. And in recent months, powerful quakes shook the island, destroying entire neighborhoods and leaving people without food, water, or power. There's been an ongoing push to get help and resources to the U.S. territory. Senator Richard Blumenthal has been demanding more must be done. He's also questioned why the island hasn't seen a fraction of the aid promised. This country has failed Puerto Rico. Only a fraction of the billions of dollars of aid promised have been provided. The administration continues to throw paper towels to Puerto Rico. Senator Blumenthal will tour parts of the island today, seeing the devastation for himself. Our coverage today on Eyewitness News will give you a much closer look at Senator Blumenthal's time there, as well as show you the heartbreak being felt back home in Connecticut, as many here in our state have family on the island. And coming up in our next half hour, I'll tell you how Governor Ned Lamont is stepping up to do his part to help those here in Connecticut. Eva Zamaris, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.